The reason the story is so legendary is because these misfits challenged Ferrari. He was a Goliath in the racing community. Yeah, and in that mix between Ford and this group of Venice Beach gearheads, they're very different, and yet they have the same goal to attempt to do the impossible. So you're going to build a car to beat Ferrari with a Ford. Correct. And how long did you tell them that you needed? 300 years? 90 days. <laughs> you think that Ford are going to let you build the car that you want the way you want it? They hate guys like us because we're different. Ken Miles is not a Ford man. We're on the verge of something. And now you tell me that I can't have the best man in the world behind the wheel? Ferrari has a message for you, sir. What did he say? He said you're not Henry Ford. You're Henry Ford II. I don't care what it costs. Go ahead, Carol. Go to war. Thank you, sir. Are you building a car that's going to beat Ferrari? We need this, Carol. We both need to get broke. I'm 45 years old. And you're good. Wait for it. Wait for it. Now. No one else wanted to put their faith in Miles. And despite all of that, Shelby saying, no, I want to bet on him. I'm putting everything on the line for him. What I love about it is how the movie centers around a friendship, and there was a real genuine respect underneath their relationship.